Hey, what's up guys? Um, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I am filming this on December 22nd. Um, and this is going to be a very good video, but poor editing and I'm not going to edit it at all. I'm just going to make this video for you guys and provide you as much value as I can. Um, and this is something that has never been talked about before. Um, not that I've ever heard of. Um, so I'm going to call it the Dropshipping Flywheel Volume 1. And there will be multiple volumes for this, but this is the base model flywheel. Um, and you can apply this to your dropshipping business right now. And I can guarantee you it helps you succeed um, moving into 2024. Um, I don't recommend you guys test any products right now as it's, you know, going up to Christmas. People are traveling and they can't even, like, you know, pick up packages that they ordered or they can't... Um, or they're just not ordering because um, they already did their Christmas shopping. So this is a good time to like hone in on your skills, practice, learn, um, and, and then start implementing things next week and then moving into uh, 2024 um, and Q5, Q1, January. So yeah, let's talk about the flywheel real quick. Um, so imagine you have a, uh, what can I draw? I mean, yeah, imagine you have a wheel, right? And there's going to be one, two, three, four notches on the wheel. Uh, four main notches and this is going to be week one, week two, week three, week four and just think of this as like a one month wheel. Um, I like to break things down by month and then that way I can break things down by the day and then at the end of the month I can analyze on what I did, what I learned, what I failed at, and what I succeeded at and then take what I learned and improve on the next month. So um, this flywheel is going to teach you how to um, become a dropshipper and um, improve all your skills um, in between because as a dropshipper you need to know a lot of things copywriting media buying store creation logo creation product development market research you know it, it, the list goes on and on um, and no one really talks about this so um, what I would do and this is what I took me a while to learn this is I broke it up into four parts because I test one product a week right so I'm testing one product here one product here one product here one product here, so four a month, um, and I'm testing with like between fifty, <coughs> between fifty and a hundred dollars. Um, so, so think of like you have your week in between here, like Monday through Sunday, right? So during this time, you should be finding out your product. You should be working on your copywriting. You know, getting your ads set up, doing the media buying. Um, yeah, getting your ads, copywriting. Getting your store set up, um, getting your domain, all all the little things in between, and you can break these down into um, different tasks, um, different skills. Um, but you do this right; it doesn't matter how good or bad you are at any of this. You know, when you when you start, you're gonna be like, you're gonna be terrible. Um, I was terrible. Everyone was terrible. Um, just how it goes, right? So you're gonna do this, and you're gonna think it's good, but it's not gonna be good, and that's okay. And you're gonna test one product. Now you're gonna analyze. You're gonna analyze your test for like I don't know, one two days right in this time period and you're probably not going to get sales right so now you're not going to quit here obviously unless you're a loser and you quit um, you're going to go back to the drawing board and when you go back to the drawing board you're not just testing on the product no you're going to go back and look at these things and improve on every single one of these so you're going to spend more time on product research once you have a product you're going to um, really try to improve your copywriting maybe try a different style uh, maybe just understand how to write headlines, how to write sub-headlines, right? And then maybe you're going to get better ad creatives. You can go to Viral Recom Ads, link down below. Um, and then you can improve your media buying skills, um, you know, whether you're advertising on... Why isn't this working? What the heck? Maybe you're advertising on TikTok, and now you want to go to Facebook, right? I, I suggest you use Facebook all of 2024 um, until, until TikTok gets better, and then... And then this flywheel is going to be adjusted as things change in the market, right? Um, and then, okay, so you improved your skills and now you're testing your second product. Now you might start getting sales, right? You might even find a winner. Um, very rarely do I see people, students, clients find winners this early on when you're just starting off. But, hey, it, it happens and I know people that it's happened to. But, again, you might get a couple sales and you might break even. You know, this you, you might have tested this for three days, right? And, and you got sales and, and you've, you were confident that everything was – that your skills were, um, you know, decent enough for a good test. 
um, but it's just not a good product. So now you're going back to the drawing sheet, you're spending more time on product research, you're building your skills, you're starting to understand what products work, what products don't, right? Because you got sales here, didn't get sales here, um, you can analyze. And then now you're still improving your other skills, copywriting, um, logo design, um, web page, um, and Shopify store, um, and your media buying skills, um, ad creatives. Um, you know, um, your your store layout is very important. I, would, I know I just said that, but, you know, you can always improve that. Um, and then now your week's gone by. And again, like you have other shit going on. You have work. Um, you have um, other responsibilities, right? And you're just spending time trying to improve every single time. Um, and then um, you test your third product. And then you do the same exact thing. So I think you guys get the point. Uh, you keep improving these skills and... You know, CRO, then you get more complicated skills. So this can be like another volume of like CRO skills, um, advanced media buying, like scaling skills. Um, you see how this is like just base volume, volume one flywheel. So what's going to happen is you're going to keep doing this. You're going to keep doing this, right? Over and over, the flywheel keeps spinning. This could take months. It took me a year, a year and a half, almost to find my first winning product. Um, I didn't know this. I had to learn this. So it would have taken me a lot. Um, it would have been a lot uh, faster. Um, and then once you're doing this, you're going to find a winning product. And now this winning product is going to have another wheel because this wheel over here is going to, is going to be different phases of scaling, maybe, uh, maybe on Facebook scaling. So then you're learning how to do vertical scaling, horizontal scaling, and you just constantly learn new things and then improve every single time. And you guys get the idea. Um, and when this wheel is spinning, right, when this wheel is spinning, you're scaling a product, this wheel is still going on because you are testing more products, having more stores. And then it gets to a point, and this could be down the road, where these, these wheels just spin on, spin on their own because you automated the process. Um, and that's the ultimate goal. I'm not going to go too in-depth. <coughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, that voice crack was terrible. Um, I'm not going to go in too much depth about um, like volume two, three, four, um, five flywheels. Not this year. Maybe maybe um, in January I'll start doing that. I want you guys to enjoy your holidays and, and not worry about the business um, during this time. Enjoy the holiday. Enjoy the New Year's. Um, but yeah, I hope this video helped. Um, and real quick, I want to show you guys the Discord. Um, if you guys are not in here, um, check it out. It's free. This is the free community. I host a call in here every single Monday. At 11 a.m. PST, I'll just post a link right here. It's a 30-minute Q&A, so you can ask me any questions about anything, um, and I'll just answer them, right? And then if you guys want to join VIP, um, Viral Ecom Ads VIP, you can go to viralecomads.com and join the VIP and get, like, $12 ad creatives. Um, very, very um, affordable. Great deal. And you get an hour-long call with me every single Friday. It's a group call. Um, another q and I'll share my screen. Other people will share their screens, and we just have a good um, conversation. So yeah, go ahead and check that out, guys. But I really hoped um, this flywheel made sense. I know it's very sloppy, but if you guys followed along, um, I think it'll make sense. So, all right, guys, if you have any questions, just, um, I don't know, follow me on Instagram or on the Discord. But happy holidays, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.